Hello, this is Eric at the Prince George Ford Pre-Owned Supercenter and we're taking a look at the 2017 Ford F-150 in an XLT trim and powered by a 2.7 liter EcoBoost engine providing you with plenty of power for towing, hauling, and 4x4ing with some excellent fuel efficiency as well. Coming with running boards down below and heavy duty mud flaps on the front and rear tires, you've got some nice accessories there. You also have a hardtop tonneau cover on the back to keep your belongings covered and protected from the elements with some box tie-down hooks on the top there. But let's take a look inside. So first look in the back where you have your rear doors that can be folded all the way back to be in line with the bed of the truck. And looking in you have seating for three that can be folded up and out of the way to accommodate any other cargo you might want to put back here. You also have fitted rubber floor mats throughout the vehicle. And in the middle you here you have two fold out cup holders and a 12 volt power outlet. Now this truck does also have a remote start so no need to go outside on those cold mornings to warm up your vehicle. And looking in you have power windows, power mirrors and power locks. Now sitting in the truck with it running, you can see it's sitting at uh, 39,616 kilometers. Moving down to the steering wheel, on the right hand side you have your hands-free phone and radio controls, and on the left you have your cruise controls and then your controls for your center info screen here, where you can look at information such as your digital speedometer, engine info, my key status, distance to empty, transmission temperature, tire pressures, and you can also go into your trip and fuel, so your trip one and two stats, and then your fuel economy, compass, and auto start stop towing information, off-road status, and settings for features around your vehicle and your screen setup in general. But then moving on to your center, your infotainment screen, which is uh, radio, Sirius, CD, Bluetooth, and I believe also, let's see, USB. So you do have quite a few options there for whatever you want to listen to, however you want to listen to it. Then above, or actually shifting into reverse then, you do also have a backup camera, so you're going to be able to see where you're going and hopefully avoid hitting anything with dynamic hitch view, so it can zoom in and hopefully have an easier time hooking up a trailer or something of the sort. But then above your screen, you have your hill descent assist, traction control shutoff, hazards, and your auto start stop shutoff. So when your vehicle is sitting idle, the engine will shut off the cut down on emissions and save you some fuel. Moving down from that, you have your physical media controls, and then your climate controls, pretty simple, easy to use. To the left of that, you have your 4x4 controls with a locking rear differential, pro trailer backup controller underneath that, and trailer brake controller at the very bottom. And on the right, you have a 12 volt power outlet. Then down below here, you have another 12 volt power outlet and a USB, so you can plug something into power charge from there. And you have a little compartment there where you can put your stuff in while it's charging or whatever you wanna do. Uh, moving on to your center console area where you have two cup holders, cubby, and your center compartment slash armrest here, which is pretty spacious. But then this does flip up and out of the way to become your fifth passenger seat and sixth seat overall, so plenty of seating in this truck. And you actually have another compartment underneath that for even more storage. And these cup holders, which can, of course, be stowed away, so you can still have drinks while this seat is folded up, or four in total. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111 or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself and have a nice day.